Hello, it's Rug Lover Mary for Love a Rug in Victoria, and today I'm going to talk about a sentimental rug. This is a 4x6 hand knotted Chinese rug that was owned by the client's dad, and now it's hers, and she wants to get it clean to use it because her dad liked the rug so much. And when I unrolled the rug, I noticed that there were some missing fibers on the back just below the fringe line. And that got me looking for moth casings. And this little guy, I instantly saw because he's pretty big. He's a quarter of an inch long. And I actually had picked him up and put him back down on the rug. And see what this little guy here. And now they are eating the rug. It's hard to see, but this little guy is actually standing almost straight up from the rug. And the larvae is in there eating the wool rug. So when you find fluff on your rugs that look like flat pieces of rice, just give them a few seconds and see if they start moving. Because chances are it's a moth casing from the clothes case making moth, especially in Victoria. These guys run rapid. We've done a lot of rugs this summer that have had the case making moth eating them. So this is always, always get your rugs cleaned once a year if they're used a lot. And always before storing, get your rugs clean so they do not become lunch for the case making moth and that little guy just popped out of his casing to move there he goes right there's a the little worm he's got a little black head so this has been rug lover mary for love a rug in victoria and if you do have a moth infestation on your rug we can use our non-toxic 